hello welcome to my channel in this video i am explaining how to generate this kinds of patterns from the images so let's get started here i am adding my keyboard inputs and mouse inputs so you can track whatever i am typing or clicking you can see here okay so first select the image let me take this one i'm just copying this image create new folder on the desktop with the name pattern and paste it paste this image here okay so now uh, we don't want to pr print pattern for whole image so we need to crop it first Okay, with that, perfect. They will copy, save it. Mm, okay. Uh, we need to change name little bit. So here. This is a cropped image. This is a original image. But you can see there is a in the background there is a noise we want to remove that noise noise in the sense we need to remove the background and fill it with the uh, solid color so go to the website remove.bg mm, this is the tool where you can change the background of the image click on it you can drag and drop the image or upload the image here i am going to drag this image in within a second it will remove the background but i want solid color okay so click on edit then click on color and i'm going to select this color and download the image okay mm, we are on the same path okay Here is the word image with remove background, right? Now we need to increase the contrast. Just follow the steps. Here I am saving this image with change little bit change in name. That's fine. Now uh, this is our original image. What we do next? We crop it then we remove the background and add the color it into it then we increase the contrast see this is the first step now in the second step we want to convert each image pixel into ASCII character so for that we have one more online tool go to the website text image and uh, here is the first website textimage.com click on it here you know we need to click on convert then click on ascii let me show you once again this is convert button then click on ascii here we have option to choose the image choose the file you can choose from here or you can simply drag and drop Get that here before converting we need to adjust the parameters like image width is 200 means we got 200 characters horizontally from the image let me select text color white because in command prompt we have text color white and background is black let me invert the image and just follow the steps okay. here is the ascii character image now in the final step we want 
to copy all this content and paste it into java code for that let me select control c copy then open the new java file for that we open edit plus or let me select the directory first the desktop okay new java file mm. then in the pattern folder oh okay so what should be our class name it can be image pattern or img pattern okay and paste here whatever we copied from the website okay so one can do print each statement line by line inside of print stat statement syntax but there are too many lines should we do it one by one of course not there is a shortcut available let me show you first See, this is how we can do it one by one but we don't want to do so we are going to use the shortcut shortcut is multi cursor command for that you need to look at my keyboard inputs now i'm going to press ctrl alt and down arrow keys simultaneously see and look at the cursor it increases one by one now it select four rows and i can write in four rows simultaneously like that okay so we are using the same thing for our all the below rows available so select the cursor in front of it each row like that adjust the cursor in front of each row only in this rows now we can type system dot out dot print line our syntax statement okay now to close the bracket we need to move the cursor at the end of the line so one can do just click right arrow one by one one by one but if we press the end button it will the cursor go directly to the end of the line like that now complete the statement now I am adding indentation so for that press the home button two tabs and we want all this content inside the block so I am just uh, cutting these two curly braces and curly braces and we don't need this hello world print statement just delete that and paste those curly braces at the end so that's it our code is ready just save this name should be mg pattern Now we need to compile this for that we are going to open the command prompt here is our code so we are opening command prompt here only let me zoom in to 
java c img pattern dot java for compilation compilation done then just run the code java img pattern here is the output well this is just printing statement this is not we cannot say it is pattern for that stay tuned i will show you some amazing patterns I want you to decode these patterns I'm presenting you. So let me open command prompt here. Java string pattern one. Not near Java. Here it will ask you enter your name in upper case. So let me type in my name. See, this is not hard coded. This is patterns. It take each character from the string and print this. How it works? It is so complicated. You can understand in the fourth program. I'm going to show you. So for that, see. It can take any kind of input and it will display the just output. It works fine for any input. Okay. So there is a little update to that. The previous program will print all characters as a star. Now here we again give a name like Java. Enter character for pattern. This character now instead of star it will print java name with this character not only this character it will work for any character any ascii character available so you can uh, let me show you once again java with 5 5 is the number but it, it is also a character so it will work there is one more update for that string pattern 3 this let me select a name sadashiv here you can see s comes with a a comes with a d comes with d a comes with a each character with pattern of each character with its own character isn't it cool okay now the last program here you will understand how each program working i'm adding intentional delay inside that so you can see how command prompt working step by step let me select any name sandesh then zoom out See, this is how command prompt working each line printing step by step from the given string characters. That's it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe the channel, like, share, and subscribe.